my girls have gotten so much out of it. This all came at an amazing time. I just wanted her to, uh, especially in college and being away from home for the first time and new people to have some, some skills. And it sounded like it was something that would benefit her. She was having really bad migraines, but then in the process, we found out that, you know, she mostly having really bad anxiety. Oh, I, and she would get up in the morning and get ready for school every day. And then she would just wow. frozen. She was really school avoidant. Step outside of their comfort zone, learn some of the tools and in initiating those connections with people mm -hmm. um, and things that kids don't really know, like subtle things, things that adults don't know. Like oh. that what you're really telling somebody by what you're doing is not necessarily what you think you are. And so learning that social intelligence, how to feel more comfortable <clears throat> in your own skin, to relate to other people, stepping outside of themselves and engaging with other people initially w without fear, going outside of their comfort zone and it being more fun. Like, you know, you know seeing things in a way Hearing them talk about their nervous system, which, you know, was something like you've really educated them on. They, they didn't know anything about that, really. Not in those words, not in that way. When she was doing her initial pledging for the sorority, she was applying all the tools that she used, initiating conversations with people mm. um, and you know, listening to people too and asking people questions. She goes, I'm doing all the things, asking people questions about themselves, but not in a way that's, you know, not authentic and yeah. really trying to listen and connect. Instead of just thinking about what I'm going to say next, people well, could feel that and just being present and really list, paying attention to what they're saying. And she was having fun that whole week. It's more about these, getting these tools and skills and everything. I feel like she applies them. I know she went to another birthday party for a girlfriend of hers that she hadn't seen in a long time. She had the most amazing time. She seems like she's doing much better. She went to an event recently um, at her high at her high school with another friend and some of her friends were on the dance team there and it was a performance they were doing. And so she was a little bit nervous to go, but also excited to go. But she told me after she got in the car, she was like, that was really fun, mom. She was like, and, and I was, I didn't feel, you know, those awkward silences that you usually have. Like, I didn't feel that at all. And I felt like I was, keep, we, I was helping keep the conversation flowing. And even if there was silence, like I, I wasn't feeling weird. Um, she's like, and then there was this other kid who I didn't necessarily want to talk to. And I'm like, oh, why did you, she goes, no, mom, James told me that it's okay to sometimes you don't have to like, you know, engage with that person either and I'm okay you know she's she's really shared what she's learned with you with myself my sister and and her father like you know expressing herself in she, like she's so eloquent when she's describing like the the things that she's learned from working with you it's been like mm. amazing at dance she something that maybe she would have been too scared of to do before so she was cast in this group, you know, catty kind of mean girl group. She, she cares less. She's just like, mm. girls are mean girling today, like whatever. Instead of getting super upset about it, yeah. she seems to be handling all of that better.